waiting for ten people again. We're gonna go to a couple temples, I think, and a floating market for food first. Day four. Is it day four? I think it's day four yesterday. So by this point, we have been in Thailand for four days now. And today we're going outside of the big city to a hidden boat market. It was about an hour away from Bangkok. So how do people stop by these shops if they wanted? I guess you gotta tell your boat person. We spent most of our day on this boat as the driver took us around the market to show us the shops on the water. We're stopping by one of the restaurants to eat that's on the boat and they serve like a lot of stuff here. Mm. <laughs> Almost dropped it. Thank you. No, it doesn't really taste like kaya. Tour also included a visit to a temple followed by an elephant ride. We can feed whichever one. We can feed okay. We also decided to check out the train market afterwards, but it was very not as expected. This was literally the slowest moving train I've ever seen. Hello! Also, instead of going inside the temple like our driver thought we were, we decided to get some banana roti on the street from this two elder couple instead. Followed by this beautiful sunset on the waterfront. We got so lucky to see this just on time. This is our first proper sit-down meal in the last two days. Two days. Is it good? No, that isn't so good. Credit thanks to Kaylee. She's gonna be our bodyguard today. The way me and Em are dressing. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna need a bodyguard. Where are we going to? Toby's. Toby's Cafe. T O B Y. We're going for some American ish food today instead of Thai food. <laughs>
Thanks for the torture. Bye. That was great. Wow. Is it? Is it? Gotta get my green faint mango oh, fix. Potatoing. <laughs> Thailand won us zero. We're waiting to go to the nail salon in a bit. up with like crimped hair <laughs> but em actually took her time to straighten it unlike us <laughs> the weather is actually like so nice today probably one of the nicest that we had since this trip decided to take the train again to cooking class our last activity of the trip it's gonna be like a four hour full cooking experience where they take you to the market Buy the ingredients and cook like a four course meal together so that'll be exciting Salty. We're gonna go to the market with them right now to choose our ingredients. Oh, they're soup as well. Oh, wow. Uh, you cook in Thailand, like the you use the uh, roots to cook. So you see, like, when you eat the soup, you see the, you see the baby corn. So apparently, Thai love putting um, or leaving roots on their vegetables when they sell it so that they stay more fresh. Leave all the roots on here so they sell so much better and stay fresher. I've been feeling so, I've been wow. But if you want to make this as oh. well, then the leaf for the flavor. Bring it, I don't know that this is good. Feeling so down, yeah. Can you tell me why? Can you tell me why? Job, everyone. Post facial baby soft skin. The glow. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> we came to this fancy mall for 
a $3 sign restaurant that looked really promising. But we saw a food court on the elevator, so we came here. And now we're eating street court side food again. Very mm -hmm. decent. Outside food is still better. Let's mark it. This one looks a little more filling. Thank God. 